how uh, how to balance the um, balance the wheel. Uh, you need to have your brake job done. You need to have your bearings already lubed. Uh, make sure that the wheel is uh, very freely rolling. It's Generally speaking, the uh, the heavy spot will be where the valve is, um, especially on the old long stem uh, uh, valves. Um, to, to determine if uh, your wheel does uh, need some static balancing, um, just roll it to any position, and, and if she decides to find its own. Uh, heavy spot, which will be at the bottom, um, it'll do like so. This one I knew was bad uh, to start with. Some wheels, you have to give them a couple of rolls, like this, uh, to find if there is a heavy spot. Um, and then just uh, use a chalk or a marker, place a mark where it thinks the heavy spot is, and give it another slow roll. And uh, see if it uh, see if it finds the same heavy spot. And uh, put a mark there. Now I'm just marking it up uh, in line with the uh, stay for the fender as being a reference point. And then uh, give it a roll the opposite direction. Oh, a little bit slower than that. Otherwise, you'll be there all day waiting for it to settle. Pretty much agreeing with itself that it's, uh, it's pretty darn near uh, 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 where that valve is. So, what you'd want to do is you would want to opposite side, uh, 180 degrees out uh, from that valve is, and uh, want to take some uh, um, plumber's solder and uh, basically. Oh, a little stiff to work with, but what you want to do is around the, the nut, the spoke nut, you want to wrap uh, pieces of solder. Use the plumber's solder because if you try to use the electrical solder, which is nice and, and fine, uh, you'll find out that you'll be there for a long time just trying to get enough wrapped around the spokes to make a difference. And you just wrap it goodly around those nuts. Get a piece that's a little stubborn, you might need to use your uh, little channel locks and give it a good a good squeeze so that it knows you mean business um, so there they are two three four there we go I've just put it around the um, four uh, Four spokes. Um, now to, uh, to to check if the the, the uh, amount of weight that you've added is good. What you do is you take the heavy spot and you put it at 90 degrees and uh, see if she wants to roll. And uh, she's so heavy, so then you would. Uh, uh, maybe add another piece and so on. There we go. Now, once you've got a, a, a goodly balance, what happens is you put it in 90 degrees, the wheel will not roll. Um, 
so you know you've got the balance good. Uh, once you've got the balance good, what you want to do is you want to take your lighter and just slightly scorch your, uh, your, your little wraps of, uh, of solder. But when you slightly scorch it, what happens is it, it surface uh, hardens them. Uh, so they'll be gripping onto those spokes uh, uh, pretty goodly. You don't really want to melt them though, because if you melt them, um, the heat from melting them could scorch the inner tube. And uh, once the inner tube is scorched, uh, it can easily fracture. Um, but that's how you, you balance a, a moped wheel. Uh, only static balance, but uh, she'll roll uh, a lot better, and uh, and you will feel a difference uh, uh, on the road.